Hi guys, I'm here with Mike at the Chris Wood Requiem. How did it go for you? What time have you been up since? Uh, I got up at four this morning, so uh, yeah, it's been a long day. And everyone chips in. How, how many crew for here tonight? Uh, only three today. Three? Yeah. Goodness me. Yeah. So that's every mic plugged in, every converter checked, every switch that's, routed. That's right, we're a bit, bit, uh, a bit tight on time this morning, but uh, we got there sort of halfway through the first session, I think. Well, you did a great uh, job. I mean, that's the hardest thing in the world to mic up an orchestra. Am I right? It's uh, yeah. It's, it's it has its it has its uh, difficulties uh, on and off. Um, yeah, it's basically every 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 job is is very different really with with an orchestra because you're always in a different venue. Um, even if it's the same orchestra, you may actually have different personnel than you had the last time, so they actually make a slightly different sound. Um, uh, even the weather conditions can actually change the sound in, in the room as well because on a cold day you get, you get different uh, uh, different to a, a humid hot summer's day uh, so um, yeah that can be that can be interesting as well and so let's talk about the mics you had about 30 mics in there 25 30 mics yes yeah, we had uh, yeah about 20 about 25 mics and we record um, onto multi track which um, can do many more than that, but we, we were only recording about 30, 32 tracks today. Okay. Including and that's into Pyramix? Yes. Okay. So the you get the raw feed through light pipe, is that right? So what it's converters are you using yeah, in front of house? The, this, this desk, SSL uh, C200, has its own bespoke mic amps in a case in the hall, and everything is digital from where the microphone gets plugged into the, to the rack. Um, gets converted to a MADI optical system, okay. which comes down. So it's MADI into the C200. Yeah. yeah okay. So it's a it's, it's an optical system uh, comes into the into the into the desk, and then it's MADI all the way through into the computers. And, and is someone operating the desk live, or do you set and forget? What, what's your what's your strategy? No, it's um, um, particularly the, the the concert just now. Uh, it was a, a live mix, basically, so riding riding faders when it gets when it gets too much and. Uh, also, the producer wasn't here today, so and he took the scores. So, to try and <laughs> so remember, you're going blind. Try and remember where all the soloists <laughs> came in, and uh, just try and massage it. But that's what we're wow. Any problems? Was there anything that you thought, oh no, what can I do? Well, we had a few noises in the hall, but that's out of our control, really. What people stamping their feet so, or sneezing? Yes. Yeah, somebody kicks a mic stand. Because uh, <laughs> you had a lot of trees, the, didn't you? I mean, we can the, see here. Uh, yes. The majority of them were on trees, weren't they? I think yes. you had two stereo. You had a stereo pair at the front, with one um, condenser mic per uh, vocalist. Uh, yes. That's and right. then you had four, so two stereo pairs on the, so on the choir. Two, two stereo main stereo pairs for the whole band, um, and outriggers, which are the wider, wider spaced omnis. Um, there was a pair of omnis in the centre of the orchestra, basically for the choir. And then four, four omnis across the front of the, of the choir. Wow. So, and then there's there's various spots for um, percussion. Because cool. uh, there, there, there were tubular bells. There were there were yeah, four actually, timpanis, weren't strangely they? Strangely enough, the, the tubular bells didn't need any spotting <laughs> because they were quite close to the choir. And a triangle. So, what do you do about triangle? SM57. Uh, again, <laughs> again, you don't need anything on the triangle. Really? It, it tends to cut right through, through the wow. right through the texture. I thought that as well. I was thinking, like, goodness me, that really does <laughs> cut through a triangle, doesn't it? Yeah, amazing, superb. Yeah, and one thing I noticed in, in the in the actual space, I, I was pretty much where this camera was. Yeah. And the plucks from the big double basses. Yeah. Were just thorough. Half. It they needed yeah. nothing. I mean, yeah. you, you, so what do you do to treat that? Wh which ones is coming through on here on the on the, um, on the, the basses? Yeah, that actually comes through on, on this one here. Okay. Um, so what so were you saying? Yeah, the, do, all, do you do any, any board setting at all? Or? Uh, just no, not really. No, very limited EQ. Really, the temps just take a little bit of the roll, a bit of the, the wooliness out of the temps, um, and the harp also uh, is just filtered. But that's literally to take the the other instruments out of it. It's, it's basically just uh, just there by itself. Uh, so everything: first violin, second violin, violas, cello, basses, harp, and horn temps. And so from the SSL, where do you go from there? Do you go through some converters or...? It's already converted, it's already digital in the console, as I say, okay. everything from stage is digital, so it goes directly to the uh, computers and the optical, and uh, gets recorded onto the hard 
drive. Track if, you, if you play it back, you can just bring everything back in as though they were playing again, and you can do a remix. Super. Well, you did a brilliant job. Thank you ever so much for all your hard effort and coffee and aspirin and everything that yeah. you had to take to get, to get through this. <laughs> well done. It was absolutely superb. Inside the auditorium, it was an amazing sound. It was beautiful. I know you did no reinforcement there, but it, it must have been fairly easy. I say that words with, with respect. To, to just capture what was very well. It was a beautiful good musicians. Yeah, it's really well. Thanks again, Mike. Appreciate spending some time with us. Cheers. You're welcome.